Oh my god, what is happening right now? Oh, so that is... What is this game? No! Alright, hello everybody, and welcome back to The Night is Grey. And we are back to carry on the adventure here, and hopefully in today's episode, find the mother of Hannah. Uh, as you all know, in the previous one, we finally managed to save Hannah uh, from the wolves, and bring her back to um, her grandparents, I guess. But now, we're in a different location, and it's finally daytime. What is that? Well, if I ever need a pile of rotted leaves, I know where to get it. <laughs> Okay, never mind. Those are just leaves. Auto's hot stuff. Do not touch. Hmm. It's not usually seeing those here, or more like I'm not usually seeing those here. But Auto does like some spicy stuff. Uh, it's his own supply, but maybe I'll take some. Yeah, take some. I'm sure he won't mind, right? Anyway, I might come in handy, or it might come in handy. Look at that. All right, we got two of them. Perfectly ripe. Maybe they'll come in handy. Hopefully they will. Oh, what the heck? Huh, what the hell? This wasn't here before. Hmm, they must have set it up during the night time. What the heck is this? I need to get around it, or more like through it. Hey, sir. Um, me? Yeah. Can I have a word, please? Um. Hi, how are you doing? Hi, how are you, sir? Uh, oh, I'm Graham. Okay. <laughs> uh, would you rather call you Graham? Yeah, sure. Sir doesn't really fit me right now. <laughs> I'm no royalty or anything. Sure, Graham. Hi, I'm, um... So, are you from NASA or something? Wait, what? <laughs> no, how would that make any sense? Uh, I don't know. You kind of look like an astronaut. What? No, I'm a researcher here, and... Wait, this isn't working. Ah, uh, much better. Oh, what what happened? You, I just, I don't know. You just don't look how I expected you to. And what exactly does that mean? Wait, no, 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 no need to be all like that. <laughs> uh, like what, Graham? I, um, it's a beautiful day, huh? <laughs> oh man. Are you... Do you have mental difficulties? All of the time. I've been getting uh, headaches. Okay, I see. I'm L, by the way. Oh, uh, nice to meet you. Look, can I go through, please? I'm looking for someone, and I need to go to the other direction to find her. Hmm, afraid I can't let you do that. Uh, maybe find another way through, or wait kind of like a month or so? Or two? There's no other way to go through. This is really urgent. Please. Sorry, Graham. My hands are tied. Why did you call me over then? Right. Well, uh, I heard you're one of the few people living in this area. That's true. Good. Just wanted to make sure. Uh, I need to inform you that this place is off limits. While we're conducting a research, it's a matter of safety, of course. But I guess that's already settled. Uh, who's we? Saren. We conduct geographic and environmental studies. But I really need to go through L. The person I'm looking for is located on the other side of this. Actually, didn't she come through? A brunette with freckles? Yeah, but she signed the form months ago. She can't go through because it's uh, on the way to her house. We couldn't just cut her off. Hmm, I really need to get to her. Can you just let me in? Just me? Just this once? Earlier you said you live here, right? The way to the village isn't cut off, unless you had a form or some kind. Do you? I, I don't have any stupid form. This is ridiculous. Just let me through. Absolutely not. Are you kidding me, game? Come on. Authorized people only. Please. No, I'd be fired. Can't make any exceptions, even if you're um a special case. Wait, what? What do you mean by that? <laughs> oh, honey. <laughs> Does she think that I'm handicapped? What the heck? Can't you really let me through? Is there anything I can do to convince you to let me through? Afraid not, Graham. Come on, I won't touch anything. You can lead me and watch me like a hawk. I'd get fired. I can't have a chance or anything. Anyone tampering with our results. This is serious stuff. It might mean a lot to the region. How so? I'm not a liberty to say. 
Okay, what if I try to go through anyway? Well, you get a reset. Do you want to get a reset, Graham? No, no, you don't, buddy. <laughs> well, uh, well done. Take it. Well, see you later. Bye, Graham. Are you kidding me, game? I do see a key over here. Hey, get out of there. I was just checking it out. Don't. Seriously? What about those boxes? They're nil shut. What do you think you're doing? I was just looking at the logo. Please, please don't go, Nijos. They are very sensitive and expensive stuff in them. Sure, sorry. If I ever need a pile of leaves, I know where to get them. Okay, so there's another pile here. I wonder if I'm going to need these piles of leaves because I've already saw two of them. Huh, look at this place. I guess they wear those suits for a reason. An air conditioner. Hmm. Guess they need to keep this place cool. That's gonna lead somewhere. Huh. Interesting. I could just over I could just jump over, but I'd probably get caught instantly and hurt my back while doing it. Hmm. Let's just scooch this over. Oh, am I pushing this away? Oh yeah, because I see a gap behind there. So I might be able to uh, go in through the gap, right? Oh, uh, it's locked. Dang it. Yeah, I figured. That zipper is locked. Interesting. I once had an accident with my jean zipper. I I don't like to remember that, but it hurt. Emotionally as well. <laughs> but that zipper didn't have a lock. Thankfully. Hmm. Alright, so I gotta find the key to open up. I'm guessing... You know what? I feel like this key is probably gonna be the key that I'm gonna have to use in order to open up that zipper. Hmm. Uh, let me go straight forward for the house there. Who is this guy? Still working on your treehouse, I see? Still being a noisy piece of... <laughs> what the heck, dude? What, what did I ever do to you? To me? Nothing. I never let you. But I know a rotten apple when I see one. Ugh, that seems unfair. Life's unfair, bucko. Strap in for the ride. What the heck? So, there's a tent blocking us to the east. Yeah. You met LA? Yep. That's a real classy lady, I'll tell you what. Hmm. You don't look like much of a lady. <laughs> you wouldn't know a difference from a real lady. And a pig wearing lipstick. <laughs> My eyesight is really bad, but not that bad. Hmm. I'm not talking about eyesight, buddy. It's about to spam me to call your brain. In your heart. Hmm. But she's wearing those baggy spaceman clothes. There you go. Prove me my point. You'll die never appreciating life's beauty. Hmm. Serves you right. God dang it, Otto. That's harsh. Even for you. Ah. See, Otto, um, you don't happen to know about a brunette with freckles? She's... Now, what does a creep like you want with that girl? Girl? No, you're thinking of a someone else. I'm pretty sure she's an adult. Ah, you're all keys to me. <laughs> Why are you looking for her? Well, um, this crazy thing's happened and, uh, forget it. I don't care. You're so boring, I can't keep listening to you. Just don't bother that girl. She's been through enough, that poor thing. Oh, really? Yeah, you're so dumb, you haven't lived enough. <laughs> I saw her recently, actually. She comes over groceries and stuff. Hmm, do you know how I can find her? Forget it, weirdo. She always goes east, and you can't get there now. What? Why not? You'll find out soon enough. What? Can you tell me more about the brunette with freckles? The question is not what I can tell you. Well, if I'm willing to tell you. Come on, Otto. I need to find her. Uh, and why is that? I bet it's a long story or something, right? <laughs> well, mind your own business. I don't want to hear it. Nice talking to you, Otto. Scram. <laughs> what the heck is wrong with this guy? I'm noticing another pile of leaves over here as well. And also, that thing back there. Hold up. I always thought three houses were for little kids. Oh, we can open this. Huh. That opens up easily. 
What the hell are you doing here, boy? Well, I'm... You know what? It's none of your business. Oh, is that so? Don't you be cute with me, you piece of poop that flies that is fly spat out? <laughs> what kind of an insult is that? A great one. I'll explain it to you, dumbass. <laughs> flies eat poop. But the source material of your piece of poop was so bad that even a fly was disgusted by it. So it spat out a small piece of poop. That's you. A microscopic piece of poop that disgusts even a creature that loves poop. <laughs> you little piece of poop. <laughs> I got it. It's just... Uh, screw you, buddy. Do whatever you want. But if it messes with me or my work in any way, I won't, I won't beat you with just my words. You got that? <laughs> oh my god, this guy, dude. I have an idea where this leads to. Maybe if I mess with this, it can distract them? Ooh. They want to keep people away from that. Hmm. That can be good for nature. Hold up. Can I maybe fill it up with um some leaves? Maybe if I fill that AC thing in my J with leaves, eventually it's gonna get clogged up. So that's gonna be the first stack of leaves. Can I put it in there? Yes, we can. Huh. That works. If I fill it up, that might do the trick, but I need more. Alright, I'm gonna go for the other ones as well and grab as many pieces of leaves as I can. So I know we have one here. Might need some more. There we go. Uh, let me go to the main entrance because I think there was another one back there, right, as well. Let me also drink a little bit of coffee. As I barely just woke up and I'm uh, jumping back into the adventure here. Really loving this game. I've had a blast with it so far. And I think that should be enough. That's what he said. Alright, perfect. Now, before I'm gonna put those leaves inside... Hold up, what about this house? Is this... Whose house is this? I know what's inside already. Don't really want to look at it. Oh wait, is this my house? Too depressing. Wish I could get far away from here. Start again. But everywhere is just really bad somehow. Where did... Uh, dang it. I lost my keys. Hey, numbskull! <laughs> Wait, hopefully he does have my keys, right? Apparently this is my house. I had no idea. So that's why El said that uh, I'm the one living out here, right? One of the few living out here. I guess you're talking to me? Of course I am, you stupid. <laughs> you left your keys in the lock. Someone could have just entered your place and stolen whatever they wanted. Freaking kids nowadays, their minds aren't right. You can't even do basic stuff. Anyway, your key is on the table between my pieces of wood. Be more careful next time. I'm not your nanny. Hey, there's the keys. Oh, thank you, Otto. Did you, um, enter the house? Wait, what? You're accusing me after I did you a solid? <laughs> what are you doing, boy? I respect privacy. Now, get out of my face before I build your home. Under the ground? <laughs> Wait, what the heck is wrong with Otto, though? Scram. Don't touch it. Aren't you a bit old for a swank? Who's to say it's for me? Oh, um, do you have a family, Otto? None of your beeswax. <laughs> what the heck, dude? Hmm, must open it first. Okay, let me use the keys on the door. Why is Otto so mean? I mean, I guess that's how people are when they live on their own, poor, and sad. Good thing the owner abandoned this place and didn't bother to take the keys. So I guess the kid was right when he said that I'm a, a hobo. Since I'm around, there's no need for uh, locking stuff and unlocking the doors. I'll just hide the keys in the usual spot. All right, hope I don't forget it again. 
Okay, look at this place. Hmm, home sweet home. Well, it's not much, but it's still one of the best places I've ever crashed at. The owner either left town after the mines closed, or he died there. Well, lucky me. That fan has never worked since I've been here. Wait, I'm noticing this stuff. Might as well take it. Hmm. Ooh. There's a real light back there. That thing sometimes gives me a slight shock. There. Is that TV working? Nope, no luck. Wish I could make it work. Hmm. I would. It would keep me company, of course. Is that a journal? Oh, it is my journal. May 3rd, lost another job. They hated me from day one, I think, to be honest. So no surprises there. Things are looking bad everywhere and I'm not getting any younger. This back is going to kill me, but I need money. Anyway, it's a good opportunity to try and start on this journal yet again, I guess. Got no one to talk to, really, so might as well. May 5th, couldn't write to yesterday. Decided to move uh, towards or the coast. I might find another job there, maybe. Writing this while uh, out in the woods, didn't have much to pack, so I'm going light and no money to sleep anywhere. This is how hobos get killed. At least, the weather is nice. I might try to hitchhike tomorrow. He is a hobo, I knew it! May 18th, it's been some crazy weeks. Could make some jobs, uh, managed to make some extra money with handy work on my way. But the best thing is, I found an abandoned place to crash at. The owner even left the keys, lying behind. I think maybe I could make a home here if nobody finds out. I might even... It's usable and it even has running rotter. I could just work on it, but I'm still broke. May 19th. Meet an interesting old man. Says he's uh, also going to make a home here. Maybe he... Maybe we'll be friends? June 1st. I hate this. I hate all this. Why is life so hard and why did I go so wrong for... Then he stopped. I got mad again. Started to lose it, and it's so embarrassing. I'm glad that I'm alone so that no one can see it happen again. What? June 10th. Had that nightmare again. It was dark, but... Managed to uh, set up a place, review my pictures. I feel alone in the house. I felt alone before, but having a place reminds me how alone I am. I wish I had a soft body sleeping next to me in bed. Someone that could... June 24th. Now I have a little bit of a feeling about this place, I can tell they also went to hell. Since the mine closed down in a terrible tragedy, the whole village went, uh, went all downside. But something gives me hope though, maybe I can still find some light in this place? I'll try it again tomorrow. Hmm. Interesting. I have so much difficulty getting my thoughts in order when I try to write, it's embarrassing. What else do I have here? I do have a gear cabinet, water, medicine, red bulb. Can I grab that? Wait just a couple of seconds. All right, that should be manageable now. Oh, there we go. Hmm, I guess that might work for something else. I'm kind of desperate anyways. I think these will turn out all right. I want to take a photo of the, uh, a look at the pictures, but apparently cannot. It's my crappy photography gear. Nobody bothered to shut down the water down, and I'm sure I'm, I'm and I'm sure as hell not gonna remind them. <laughs> exactly, we're definitely not gonna remind anybody. The bed where I lie alone every night. Hmm. Kitchen cabinet. Anything there? No use looking in there. I know it's empty. It usually is. We got a metal pot here as well. I cook almost everything in there. Hmm. Do have a lot more kitchen stuff. All right, I think I got everything that I needed from the house. Uh, let me try to put those leaves in the air vent. Let's see if I can mess up with uh, the people here, and hopefully, I will be able to distract them or something. Hey, Otto, what do you want now? Can't you see I'm busy? Are those glasses just for show? Use your eyes. <laughs> anyway, uh, never mind. I cannot talk with him. This guy, dude. Alright, so, uh, let's get more leaves inside here. Just some more leaves, and that ought to cover it.
Hey, there we go. Worked. There. Properly ruined. Ugh. The ventilator's down. What? Did the power did the power went off again? Doesn't look like it. Ugh, dang it. Hope it's not broken. I'm not that kind of an engineer. If it is, it will take at least a week for someone to come on over and fix it. Yeah, go talk to Dr. E. Why me? Well, she scares me. <laughs> It'll just annoys you. Yeah, well, you deal with her better than me. Go see if she might know what to do now. Ugh, sure. But you will deal with Bob next time. God dang it. <laughs> Alright, now they're distracted for sure. And uh, let's keep her going. They're distracted. If I want to find her, I have to take advantage of this. I bet that the key on the uh, on the info board will help me out. Okay, so as they're talking, they're not gonna pay attention to me, so I will I will be able to get it right. Okay, let's look at this. Keys coming handy. There we go, we got it. Previous collections from nearby areas will seem to indicate larger amounts of the unknown compound concentration escalating as we get closer to area 815. Unless our hypothesis is incorrect and there are unlikely as it is several sources of the compound. What? Our way of deducting the presence of the compound has proven effective, although we are technically limited on size since the machinery needs uh, needed to detect it uh, and isolate it. It can be transported. We found that the presence of high concentrations of Fe. 32 H2O, so there's something in the water, right? H2O is water. Uh, usually accompany the presence of compound itself. Uh, that with the presence of the ripe pH and the water solution becoming red is usually a good indicator. Although confirmation is always needed via sending the samples to headquarters for further testing. As a final note, I did find important to leave the writing that while we're working with the local government to implement safety measures to diminish people's possibility of exposure to the compound without generating an uh, unjustified health crisis, there's no uh, not much to be done at the fauna and flora. Hmm. I understand almost nothing of that. <laughs> They're looking for some anomalous chemicals in the water that turns it red? Yep, that's exactly all I understood as well. All right, so I got a key. I'm guessing the key is always saying it's probably gonna be for this lock. So use this and this. Oh, look at that, the vent is actually off. Awesome, though it works. Okay, let's see if this... Hey, unlocked. Awesome, there we go. Oh God, I can't get caught. Gotta be like those guys in spy movies. Okay, so we got quite a bit of stuff we got to interact with, but I'm also noticing this guy passing by. So I'm guessing uh, if I want to cross the other side, I got to make sure this guy doesn't see me, right? Yeah. What about these? Oh, just grab the flask. I don't think they will miss one tiny little flask. They've been testing different spots, looking for something in the water. Hmm. Maybe they have aspirin here. My headaches have been uh, of the murderous kind lately. No such luck. Just weird chemicals. Alright, let me wait for this guy to pass before I'm gonna cross. So he doesn't see me. There we go. I can't really understand that. Results are all over the place. But I guess they're looking for at the water speed H level. It's a machine. It does machine things. <laughs> I can use this with the flask. Okay. Ooh, I guess they're seeing it. The water changes to red. Hmm. Maybe I can get some red water to fool them. Uh, that gives me an idea. Okay, so maybe if I now that I have the flask, maybe if somehow I make some red water, I can hopefully fool them somehow. All right, let me get out of here. So I gotta make sure they're not gonna spawn me because if they're gonna spawn me, they're probably gonna arrest me. All right, let me keep on going this way. Let me see how, how I can get myself some red water. Now, they're definitely testing this water here, right? Um, can I use the bulb? Maybe cook the bulb in this? Well, this one thing never tried to cook before. Oh, we can do that. Okay, never mind. That works. I mean, it is a red bulb, so hopefully it is going to give me the result that I need. I'm hearing him uh, cooking in the background.
<laughs> seeing red. Maybe this will fool them? Okay. So I guess I got myself a red flask of water. Yep, it is red. So I think what I gotta do now is just uh, set it off in the tent. And uh, hopefully they're gonna see it and it's gonna fool them. I don't know. Alright, grab the flask and use it with this. Here goes nothing. Ah, oh, dang it. Why did it have to make so much noise? Better leave before someone comes to check it out. Hey, why did you put a sample for testing without registering it? I didn't do such thing. This sample here, I didn't do it. Mm, neither did I, but who did it? Maybe Bob did it? That jackass. <laughs> Forget about that. This looks promising. Put it on the uh, spectrometer. Okay, sure. Huh? What? It's nothing that makes sense. Not what we're looking for, for sure. Thank you, Bob. What a waste of time. Okay. Glad this Bob guy is taking the fall. Maybe I can get away with trying this again? Oh. Okay. So I guess I gotta go back and get another flask. So let's grab another one. Okay, I don't think they'll miss one tiny little flask. So I guess I gotta cook something else this time, right? Because apparently that did not work. Hmm. I mean, I also have the spicy stuff that I could cook. The spicy peppers. I don't know if the spicy peppers are gonna make the water red, but... I guess we're gonna have to try. Ooh, hold up. Auto does have some red things here. Are those also spicy peppers? See, Otto, are you gonna use those nails? What? No, they're all rusty. I left them too long out here. It's just trash. Maybe I can have them then? Mm, now, why the heck do you want them? Hey, I'm just taking them off your hands. Isn't that what matters? <laughs> uh, you take them if that means you leave me alone. Such a weird dude you are. <laughs> well, I got myself some rusty nails. I might try something with these later on. I feel like maybe the nails are the ones that I needed. The nails were definitely not there before. And I feel like the nails might have some metals in them that may actually um, do something about the testing. So let's try the nails instead. Hopefully this works. I hope it does. I really, really hope it does. Maybe this will fool them? Okay, maybe. Finger crossed that it actually fools them. Alright, let him pass. Cross now. And use this with the machine. Alright, come on. This time, it should work. Another one? Ah, uh, screw this. I'm gonna go get Bob. Before you do that, uh, let's just test it, okay? We're just wasting our time. I know, damn it, but just make sure. Alright, I'll run it. So? Hmm. Wait, wait just a second. Let me double check it. What? Well, what is it? I, I think this is it. You're kidding me, right? I'm not, I swear. It's not quite right, but one of the compounds is really close. There's room for a variation. Where did it come from? I don't know. This one is also not registered. Oh, dang it. This might be it. And if we didn't follow the procedure, we're all screwed. Hmm. We need to report it. Let's get to the bottom of this. Yeah, let's leave for today. Uh, get everything ready. Oh, God dang it. It's going to be a long time, isn't it? I was looking forward to it for a couple of beers. Uh, anyway, let's just go. Okay, I think this uh, I think this may be my dumb luck, I guess. Gotta take my chance now that they're gone. Hey, I think we finished up another chapter. Awesome. That's right. Go lock yourself in that little dark room again. 
Hide away from the big scary world. You're pathetic. No one will ever love you. What the heck? Who would even say something like this to people? Unless you make them. What the heck, dude? They finally left? Awesome! Finally. Hmm. They really are gone, huh? I wonder what's so special about water. Uh, let me see if I can chat with Otto first. Before I'm gonna go exploring this place. Oh! Hey! Uh, what? So I'm going around those science nerds a lot. And now they're gone, running in a hell of a hullabaloo. <laughs> Did you do something, boy? Uh, stop being suspicious all the time. It's none of your business anyway. Ah, you bet it's my business. When it happens right in front of me. You're cooking something, boy. And I don't like the smell of it. Just let me be, okay? Are you done with your treehouse? Is you stupid? Is you blind? Is this conversation not finished already? <laughs> what? What the heck? Uh, as always, real nice talking to you. Scram, kid. Huh. I see that he does have a hammer here. The most useful tools. Having the hammer will be useful. I have a feeling I'm gonna need to get me that hammer somehow from him. But I wonder how I'm gonna get that. What if I give him the spices? What do you got there? Oh, just some peppers. You don't really look like the cooking food type, only the cooking trouble type. Well, I found these and... Stealing from someone's garden, I see. <laughs> what? No, I... Hmm, better keep my eyes on you. You want to steal all? My stuff from me, don't ya? Oh, come on, Otto. What do you even have to take? My dignity, unlike you, you armpit sniffer. <laughs> what? Armpit sniffer? What did you even come up with these? I see how you smell yourself. Because you never take a bath. I bet it's a sick thing that you do, isn't it? Otto, what the heck are you talking about? I knew it! Please, can I have some of your peppers? You already touched them. I don't want them back. But if you take any more, you'll feel the heat already. The heat of a hell hellfire. <laughs> Thank you for your kindness. <laughs> Man, this Otto guy. Just cracking me up. Um, I wonder if there's anything else that I gotta do. They definitely left in a hurry, right? But I'm not seeing them dropping anything around here, so I don't think I can go back. So I guess it's time for me to now explore the uh, other side of the tent, right? We cannot go through that, I'm pretty sure they locked that up. So what I'm gonna do, just simply go through the tent. Can I grab one more of these, I wonder? Oh, you can! Okay, I guess I can take one more of these now. Doesn't matter. Okay, we got us just a flask. Maybe I'm gonna need it for something, I don't know. Huh. They all left. I got this all by myself now. A workstation of sorts. Nothing useful here. These guys really are obsessed about water. Hmm. Barrels. Filled with seawater, I bet. I guess this is how they've been keeping samples. I think those are for pr uh, predicting the water or the weather. Have no idea. Something. No need to read that now. All right, let's keep going then, buddy. Oh, look at that! We finally made it to the lighthouse. Are you kidding me? I love it that this area, this game, had so many uh, regions we had to explore. So cool. Oh, damn it! Did they just really need to close the path up? Well, on the plus side, they definitely are gone now. Left in a hurry. Wonder what's so important about the water. Anyway, uh, what now? Maybe I can get her bearing on top of the lighthouse? Always wanted to visit one. So what do we got here? Closed path. Damn it. I need to go through the uh, road. I didn't think they'd go as far as the closet. Gotta find another way. Some directions. Um... Maybe I can use the boat to just go to the other side, right? Because as we started the game, as you guys remember, there was a boat. A 
course, we couldn't use because it was uh, messed up. But maybe we can use this one. I guess if I knew where to go, I could use the boat from here forward, right? But I hate boats. I hate the water. I always found those water buoys silly. Don't know why. I just do. Huh. Look at this place. We got a warning site here. Yeah, I'm already here, and I'm not leaving because of that. <laughs> we got fishing stuff. I guess the lighthouse keeper really likes fishing. Great for catching crabs and stuff. Hmm. I think hippies call that a dream catcher. It's supposed to trap nightmares, but it doesn't work on me. Wait, I don't. That's not a. That's a wind chime, buddy. Just random stuff. Nothing useful here. Hmm. Not gonna need that. I mean, I'm not looking to kidnap anyone. <laughs> the housekeeper must use this for fire pits or for keeping warm, I guess. All right, let's go inside. Hopefully the doors are not locked. Maybe I can see her from up here if I look from the top of the lighthouse. I wonder if someone's inside. How do I expect uh, something to be up there to hear a knock on the door? Hey, anyone there? Hello? Hmm, ah, uh, to hell with that. Maybe it's... Hey, it is not locked. Nice. Finally, we're getting some doors that are not locked. Finally, we're getting some doors that are not locked. Unlocked? Huh, that's lucky. Hey, hello? Anybody? Home, I guess? Um... No? Well, I think I'm alone. No need to shout like I lost my mind. <laughs> oh my god, so many things we can explore here. It's all rusted up. Mm, I doubt you can properly hold any liquid without uh, tainting it. Guess the lighthouse housekeeper is not too keen on cleaning dishes. Hmm. Nothing in there that's useful to me. Lots of dirty clothes. Ew. <laughs> Must get chilly up here. I suck at fishing. But that looks like a really good fishing pole. Fish look kind of silly out of water. Imagine if that thing just started singing or something. <laughs> a wall thermometer. It's warm now, but it will get cold soon. I don't think that the clock is working. Huh. That's your rocks. Once I almost broke a toe on one of those, my mother was using it and accidentally put my foot beneath it. Her whole way just ran over my foot. Mm, I think it actually might have broken uh, that toe. <laughs> Guess that the keeper brings uh, his fish up here to prepare it. Let's see what's inside. Huh, a journal. September 1st, 1977. Nothing to report. Technology really is something. Nowadays, the lighthouse mostly runs by itself. It used to be that I had to live here most of the time, and now I just have to come and check uh, once or twice a week or and do some maintenance. I think soon my profession will cease to exist, at least as I know it. But technology can only go so far. Machines and like won't understand things that don't work perfectly. They won't figure out how to go around in perfection to make things work. Like finding out that a stubborn old door just needs a well-placed kick under it to finally open. Ah, I wonder if this is kind of like a, um, a hint telling me how to open up a door that I'm going to be coming through. Maybe the door behind there is going to be something going to be able to open by kicking it. I don't know. Hmm. Let's see. Well, still need equally stubborn old man to lose their patience and accidentally find out what works. At least, I hope so. Is there anything else? Huh? Oh, wonder why he marked an old entry with a leaf. Ah, that's true, there is a leaf here. Look at that. Dear daughter, I found myself writing this in my journal for practice. Not sure if it's for a letter or something I should tell you in person. Many of my time were never taught how to handle these things. But as I get older, I think I might be getting a clear picture of life. At least, I hope so. Yesterday when you came up here and during that dreadful fight, I think we finally saw each other's true light. And that's killing me, Ava. 
I'm so sorry for what I said before. I'm even more sorry for, for what I didn't do for you four years ago. After what the uh, Peltier's boy did to you, I should have uh, scorched the whole damn earth. That's what you wanted to happen, and that's what you deserve. Instead, I thought I was being a sensitive adult and doing what was best for you. I'm sure his father thought the same, and how could I find such a powerful man? I thought that uh, accepting the money and the lodge for you and your daughter to live in was the lesser of the two evils. <gasps> Wait, is this actually the father of the woman that I'm looking for, of course, Ava, which is, of course, the mother of Hannah? Are you kidding me? But you were right when you told me that I too was hiding my shame by sending you there. But now I see I'm not ashamed of you. I'm ashamed of myself. You are just a kid and what that boy forced upon you is unspeakable. I wanted to kill that little piece of poop I should have. Still, I can't help thinking that I was part of the God's plan. I know it hurts you to hear that and, and for me to think that the God is so cruel and apparently side with him. But if that terrible thing didn't happen, I wouldn't have my sweet and beautiful granddaughter. I do wish you would let us see her more often though. I now know how painful it is for you to visit us and don't blame you. Uh, but I do hope that someday we can make that change if we all try. Don't take it out of her, okay? She can have a family even if it's not a perfect one. I hope you like the wind chimes I made for you. Oh yeah, that is another confirmation because there were some wind chimes, right? By the, uh, by the, by the house have one just like it. Maybe it will mean that we're listening to the same song of the same wind. I also got a small boat now so I can come to you more often, if you like. I named it after my strong, bold and stubborn daughter. I hope that'll help her to see how much uh, she means to me. P.S. I know I told you that being called grandpa made me uh, feel old, but I thought about but I thought about it a bit and I think I found a solution. Tell Hannah that she can t call me GP. No way! Are you kidding me? So it is her grandpa. So that's why the boat is called Ava. Hmm, lots of drama in this old man's life. I love that the story is coming along together now as we're getting closer to the ending. Is that a bird or a fish? Lots of family photos. Hey, there we go. So these are the grandparents, and this is Ava. Hmm, they look like happy family, cute kids. They seem to get along, huh? That face is kind of familiar. Yeah, so of course Ava looks alike, or more like Hannah looks alike like her mother, right? Which is Ava, which is her when he used to be younger. That is so cool. All right, I'm s I'll see if I can find something out of this advantage point, and then I'm out of here. No harm, no foul. Okay, so that door was open apparently. Interesting. But of course we have another door. And I'm guessing this one's gonna be locked. Hmm. I can't open it. Damn it. Empty boxes, old schedule. Ooh, door dance. So because of course we read that journal, we now know about this uh, the door dance, right? So maybe if I kick it, I can't open it. Damn it. Wait, what? The journal says something about kicking the door. Well, might as well try. Got some pent frustration to release anyway. <laughs> hey, it worked. Nothing a little violence can solve. There we go. Nice. A spyglass. Maybe I can find a path or even see her. There, there. That's gotta be her. I, I gotta. How do I? Hmm. If I took the boat downstairs, I'd be able to reach her in no time. Ah, oh, dang it. That's gotta be it. I gotta do it. Why does the lighthouse keeper have a spyglass pointing in that direction? Weird. Wait, Graham. Why are you not getting it, buddy? The lighthouse keeper is the grandparent of Ava, which Ava is the mother of Hannah. Why are you not getting it, buddy? I already got it. Uh, can I go up here? Those lead to the top. Mm, no thanks. If I fell and broke my neck, I wonder how long it take for someone to find my body. <laughs> Hold up, he doesn't want to go up here, but I do see a rope on this side, though. Huh. What's this for? A 
wine bottle. The lighthouse keeper must have left in the water. Hmm, to chill it? Lucky I didn't break it on the rocks or something. Can I grab it? Um, uh, can I tangle the rope? Must have been in the water for a long time. It's all gunked up. Almost like it fused together. What now? Wait, what? Uh, can I use the quirk to maybe at least open it up? Okay, that sound is good. There, unscrewed. Now what? Can't take the bottle with me. Hmm. Can I maybe put the wine in here? This will have to do. Ah, uh, there we go. I'm grabbing some wine. Oh, you know what? We may gotta give this to Otto. It's a weird place to keep wine, but let's say I decanted it. <laughs> hmm. Let's have the course crew as payments. Let's say we're even. Wait, what? So did I actually plug that with the course crew? Can I put this in here? I could play a prank on Otto, but he'd probably think I was trying to poison him. I'd rather not have him accusing me of a tender murder. <laughs> Okay, buddy, well, I maybe I just gotta give him this, and he's gonna be friends with me? I don't know. Let's try that out. At least I came up here, I got myself some wine. I, of course, did not find what I was looking for. I was hoping that I could find maybe, like, the oars for the boats inside the, uh, lighthouse. But it looks like I wasn't lucky enough. The keeper might show up any time. Yeah, let's get out of here, buddy. Hmm, didn't find any paddles. Maybe he takes them with him? Hmm, so no one steals the boat? Dang it, I know where I can get a paddle. I really don't want to go there though, but now I know where she is. I gotta just stuck it up and do it. Wait, what? Huh, a wind chime. Thought it was a dream catcher. So he says that he knows where he has to go to get the paddles. Wait, does that mean that I gotta go back to the grandparents to try to get the paddles? Or do I have to go to Otto? I could get here by boat, but I didn't see any paddles in the lighthouse. I know where to find ones, but I really don't want to go back there. Oh no. Wait, what? What do you, what do you mean? He says that he knows where to find some, but I have no clue what he means by that. Does he mean my home? Do I have to go back home? Because every single time uh, I went back home, or every single time I went home, he said that he doesn't want to go there. So maybe that's what he means? What about these ones? They're nailed shut. Alright, let me chat with this guy. Hey, Otto. Looks like you're done, huh? How are you today? That makes sense. A short talk from someone with a short brain. <laughs> I don't think that's a real expression. What do you want? Um, about the lighthouse. This guy shared a bottle with him once. Wait a minute. Why are you asking me? Just wanted to know more about him. You're being a creep, you know that? You leave them folks alone. Poor man had trouble enough. No need to deal with you on top of it all. You hear me? Damn, Otto, just relax, you old coot. What did you just call me? <laughs> Nothing? Thought so. What story of this place can you tell me? Ah, uh, nothing that's interesting to you. Most of the stories around here are all village gossip. Mostly about the politiers. Bastards. You sound like you hate them. Is that because of the mine? You work there, right? Ah, uh, the mines, that's just business. People screw up business all the time. But the other stuff. What that rich, poor Brad did to the lighthouse keeper's daughter, uh, protected by daddy, never got what he deserved. Disgusting. What? What happened? None of your business. Just don't want to gossip, not with your swords. We ain't pals, okay? You're dying to talk about it, eh? Just tell me. You wish I was dying. I'll outlive you. I will outlive you, you stinky piece of poop. <laughs> Fine, be like that then. Can you lend me your hammer, buddy? I'll bring it back. 
it will just take five minutes max. In five minutes, a dozen of my buddies died. In five minutes, I fell in love once. And in five minutes, I ruined the uh, poop out of that. A lot can happen in five minutes, boy. That's uh, very intriguing, Otto. And in five minutes, I'll smash your head in. <laughs> if you didn't get out of my face. Dang it, dude. You have known. Hmm. Look, what I will give you something. What, look, what can I give you something in return? You have nothing to give me. Numbskull? <laughs> well, we'll see about that. You know what? I think I I think I understand what I gotta do here. I think I need the uh, hammer in order to get those boards off of my uh, other door in the house. But I gotta give him something in return. And guess what? We got wine for him. Hey, Otto. Guess what I have here? Poison? What? Well, kinda. It's wine. Mighty weird looking wine bottle you got here, buddy. Well, I had to improvise, but it is wine. Would you have it? Um, what's the catch? I'll trade for the hammer. <laughs> I knew to ask for something, you weasel. Well, I was hard coming by this. It's a fair trade. Uh, I won't give you my hammer, you scum, but I'll lend it to you. A little temporary. You have until I finish drinking to give me my hammer back, you hear? And that's final. <laughs> Sure, okay. There we go, we got a hammer. I'll give you a hammer in a second. Mm, you better. Right, no, no, don't go back. Oh, actually, hold up. These are nailed shut, right? Can I use the hammer to open them up? Not just bumping between those until something happens. Wait, what? What do you mean, buddy? Just use the hammer to get on the nails out. Anyway, uh, let me go in my house then. Let me see if I can use... Oh! Ah, he put the peppers in there. So it doesn't go to waste. I get it. Okay, never mind. Uh, let me use the hammer then. With this. I promised myself I wouldn't go back there. Uh, I guess this had to be done. I'm really curious what he's actually hiding in that room, to be honest. Kind of creeped by it as well. Hey boy, time's up. Give me my hammer back. <laughs> oh, that was quick. You hear me? We had a deal. Now, give it back. Hold up, buddy. Hold up. Oh my god, he's drinking so fast. Here's your hammer back. Took your sweet time with it. <laughs> Afraid I can give you your wine back. Um... Already done, I see, huh? Yep, you judging me, boy? Joke's on you. Let's see who will be judging the. Let's see who will be judging the harshest in the end. Whatever you say, Otto. All right, I don't think I need that stuff back. Oh wait, stop! Stop it! Go back, Ram. I gotta go to the house. I gotta see where we're hiding back there. Oh, we got a ship. What? Hmm. Haven't used this place since last time. Uh, that night, actually. Headache got real bad. Felt I was gonna lose my mind. Had to be alone. What? I hate being here. Just gonna get what I need and leave. Destroy boats. Uh, use the wood from the wrecked boat to board up the door. This is the place where I'm at my lowest. What actually happened though, I wonder? I got no clue. Let's go inside then. Ooh, I see the oars. I shouldn't have come here. It brings out the worst in me. Left some cigarettes in there, though. Oh, it's just the last one, apparently. Huh. Only one. Better than nothing. I'll just grab the pedals and leave the sticky place. Empty bottles. Got a bit carried away last time. 
That was a depressing night. Can I check the photos though? Huh. Look at the photographs. Look at the photos in the game. Seriously? Did I already look at all the photos in the game? A bad photo, but I had to be subtle. People around here don't like knowing someone just taking pictures of them. Don't want anyone to think that I'm a weirdo. This was the best picture I managed to take of that day. Hmm. All right, let's grab the uh, petals then. There we go. And um, I think that's it. They don't want to come here. But at least I uh, got what I needed. Okay, now I'll I'll just... Oh, uh, dang it. No, not again. Another headache. No, not now. Come on. What is happening? Am I about to wake up during the night time? Oh. We did. Oh, are you kidding me? Come on, game. No. Well, that lasted uh, not that long. <laughs> how how long was I out? I got no clue, buddy, but uh, hopefully we're going to be able to get out of this place. My God, the nighttime is here again. Are you kidding me? I was out for quite a while, apparently. And I do not like the music. Oh, I gotta, it's got really late already. I should go right now to uh, No Time to Waste. Unfortunately, we did waste quite a lot of time. And that is no good. Hopefully, the, uh, the woman didn't leave already. We gotta find Ava eventually. I have a feeling we're gonna be in a loop here. Because we're gonna start up the game adventure with just one cigarette again. I guess I could use that boat from here forward, right? I hate boats. I just hate the water. God dang it. Okay. I gotta be brave now. It'll all be worth it. Let's go. Man, this has been such an awesome adventure, though. I really enjoyed the adventure every step of the way, to be honest. Really enjoyed it. Screw it. I can't take this anymore. I'm too scared of the water. This is good enough. I'll do the rest by foot. I mean, this this is it. I'm doing it. I'm... Wait, am I fainting again? I'm sick of you. I might just let the wolves take you. What? What is happening? I don't like this. Some... Someone there? Am I hearing voices? There's always something wrong with you, isn't there? Should have smacked you harder. It worked on your brother. What? Look at these eyes here. What a stupid mind filled with scum. You deserve to die like your father. What? You're so rotten since you were born. Only an evil thing like you would decide to ruin your mother. What? Those wolves are back there. I don't like it. No. Stop it. Leave me alone. She'll understand. She'll see the good in me. I'm better now. I'm a grown man. Be a man for once. <gasps> We're at the same spot. Are you kidding me, game? I do not like this at all. This is going to be just a big, big loop that we're going through. With the exception that we're not coming here running. Huh? Looks like the lighthouse keeper just got there. Hmm. Hope he's not too mad about the boats. I'll give it back. And of course, the Kraken again. Wait, what? What was that noise? Oh, there's somebody turning on the lights. That's what's happening. That's Ava.
That's that's her. I have to ignore everything else. I did a lot to get here. She'll understand. I know she will. Um, hello? Uh, what? Who are you? Hi. I'm Graham. Uh, what are you doing here? I came to find you. I've been looking for you. Do I know you? No? That's the thing. I I just had to meet you. Sure. Well, now we've met. Have a nice day. <laughs> no, wait. Uh, you don't understand. Oh, what don't I understand? I, I've seen you from afar. So, many times. And I couldn't help feeling... I couldn't help thinking that... We've got to have something very deep in common. I'm so sorry. I don't really know what I'm saying. I'm screwing up everything. I guess I'm nervous. I... Oh my god, guys. Hold up. I have a bad feeling about this. I have a feeling I've been playing the whole game with a murderer, which is Graham. And I do not like where this is going. Oh no. Are you kidding me? I really thought this is not going to be the type of game. I just had to know you. The path? What? The path is blocked. And you don't live here, so you don't have a permit. How did you get here? I found a boat at the lighthouse. Uh, this is embarrassing, but it shows you how much I was willing to do just to meet you. I kind of borrowed the boat. And I'm really scared of the water. But it was the only way, and then I found one in the lighthouse. You stole my dad's boat? What did you do to him? Oh god, I hope I didn't do anything to him. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know that. I didn't know that he was... Oh, uh, so you're called Ava? Hmm, that's a wonderful name. Look, why don't we start over? I... What the heck? Don't come any closer. I'll kill you, you delusional bastard. Come here like this, you freaking loon. Get away from my home now! No, 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 wait, this this is not how this was supposed to go. Just shut up! Go away! Now! I don't want to know you. You think you can fool everyone? You can't fool me. Stop it! I know where you really are. You need to see them who I am! Weak. Don't come any closer! You will run away, and the wolves will catch you. You'll be screaming for help, but no one will come because no one loves you. What? You can't run away. Oh my god, what is happening right now? Oh, so that is... What is this game? No! Oh my god. I cannot believe what just happened. Are you kidding me right now, game? And that's all your fault. That is why Otto was so mean to us, because he knew what type of person we were. Oh my god, no, come on. Now I want to know what happened to Hannah. Oh. We actually went on a loop. That's what happened. No way. This guy is a murderer. Are you kidding me right now? Uh, I don't want to play with him anymore. <laughs> this guy is sick. He needs help. What the heck? No. I do not like this at all. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to. Oh, God. It didn't happen. It, it didn't. I must have imagined it. It just... 
And now he's seeing the wolves. What the? Why? Our family is together. Go away. What? Dude, this thing is turning again. What is happening? This game is so weird. Stop crying and listen to your mother, Graham. Do as I say, and then I will love you. But if you don't... Uh, if I don't what? If you don't behave, the wolves will come at night. They will take you away as you scream. And I'll be laughing the whole time with no love to give. Do you hear me, you spoiled little brats? Oh my god, this is exactly how the game started. I hate this. I really hate this. No. Although I really love the adventure, the story and everything. I didn't think that we were playing as a murderer. Are you kidding me? And this is exactly how the game started. Of course it did. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, what the... I gotta get out of here. Some, Someone there? Wait, is it all just repeating? Am I gonna be even able to change what has happened here? I'll check it out later. I should go find what made that noise. Is this thing gonna repeat, I wonder? That is so weird. There's... There's a house. I wonder... <sighs> I hope it didn't do anything wrong to Hannah, though. Nothing scary about a creaky door that opens in the middle of nowhere. Hello? Someone there? <clears throat> Anybody home? Stop right there, or well, our fire! I have a, I have a gun. What? Don't shoot! I. Are you? Are you just a kid? I'm a person that has a gun, and you don't scare me, monster. I'm not a monster. Unfortunately, Graham. Unfortunately, you are. Oh my god, this game had the weirdest turnaround ever. I really, really love what developers did. I was not expecting that though. Definitely not expecting that. I was definitely expecting something weird to happen, but not that. Oh my god, that was so good though. <laughs> anyway guys, that being said, thank you all for uh, sticking around, watching this entire series. If you did, make sure you leave a like down below. This was very unexpected. Very, very delusional character we played with. <sighs> I kind of hate it, but at the same time, I love it as well. Anyway, you guys let me know what you think about it in the comments below. Of course, a very, very bad ending here, but uh, it was very well told. Really enjoyed it. All right, and that being said, guys, thank you very much for watching. Another thanks to the developers for providing a review copy share again with you all. Uh, as usual, if you guys are interested in getting one grab for yourselves, check out the links down below in the description. This would make for a perfect gift for people that enjoy these type of games. So uh, make sure you grab it, give it to some uh, special one, and uh, I'll see you on the next one. Bye, everybody.